Hi you guys and welcome back to my channel. It's Jacoby. So welcome back. Um, so today I'm going to be budgeting my YouTube paycheck. And if you're curious on why and how I have a YouTube paycheck, it's because I have a completely separate channel called Jacoby Volleyball. And I just talk about volleyball on there pretty much. And I've had that channel for years, okay? And I that was like my baby. I grinded on it for a really long time. So also excuse my voice. I'm pretty sick right now and congested. But um, I have about maybe 7,100 subscribers on that channel. So I've been monetized for a while. And I really don't post on that channel like I should. So I'm trying to get back into that. But um, yeah, I got my YouTube paycheck. So I accumulated over the months. <clears throat> So that totaled $126, so we're just going to budget and see where we're going to put our money. So first and foremost, let me show y'all. I got a new binder. Literally so cute. Um, I'm pretty sure it's from Crafty Budgeting Girl, but I will put it on the screen from where it's from. Um, so cute. It's pink binder. It says, no, you hang up with the ghost face. It's so cute. And then I just got my, I basically redid my high priority binder. So I got credit card here, emergency fund, <clears throat> car maintenance, new car, student loans, and rollover. And this is just for, you know, my rollover from the variable expense binder that I will try to let accumulate in here. Emphasis on try because I get indecisive, okay? But yeah, I had to show you all that. But okay, let's get to budgeting. So... First binder is this one, which is the high priority binder. So that has credit card and so on, like I just said. And I don't really want to contribute. I know I should. Okay, guys, I know, but I just don't want to. It's like kind of like a mental game for me. And it doesn't it doesn't feel right. It does not feel right going to like these kind of categories. I don't know. This is kind of like extra side hustle money. So I feel like I should put it towards stuff I usually don't stop. So, but I'm not going to skip emergency just because I'm trying I'm trying to buff that up. So that's just gonna get ten dollars. And I'm gonna write down the denomination right now just so I remember later. Okay. <clears throat> and that's like one ten dollar bill. That's how I write it down. Okay, so let's erase this. And that total was ten dollars. Oops, and now we have one sixteen left over. Now we are going into our long-term sinking funds. Month ahead, we'll be getting $10 because I am really trying to get a month ahead because y'all, the military pay is so weird because we were supposed to get paid, you know, bi-weekly as you would think, but we got paid last time we got paid was May 12th with his um, full-time Marine Corps check, right? Next time we're getting paid is literally May 31st. So I'm like, oh my God, I don't know. Like that's, now I understand why people are like, oh, like, you really should focus on getting a month ahead. I didn't think it was that serious, but, girl, it is that serious. I was like, oh, my God, like, because we, I don't know what we're going to do. We're going to have to dip into our emergency fund, I guess, because I just wasn't prepared for this. And I feel like such a failure, but my husband's like, it's okay, like, you didn't know. And I was like, yeah, I should have known, but, but that's, it's fine. So, yeah, just have a little, just have to vent about that. So annuals will be getting skipped, down payment skipped, retirement will be getting $10. And keep in mind, my husband does have like a TSP, which is like the military 401k. So we do have that. And then I'm just saving a, a little bit in cash. Like a little like, oh, I forgot I had this money kind of savings kind of deal. Okay, <clears throat> so that's it for long term. So that's uh, $20 right there. So what do we have left over? We had 116 so that's subtracted by 20 is $96. Honestly, this is a nice little armrest. <laughs> okay, now we're moving on to our, um, what is this called? Mid-priority sinking funds. <clears throat> Disney, USMC tattoos, wedding, moving, we'll all be getting skipped. Travel, I need some help buffing up this as much as I can so even if it's a small amount you know every dollar counts so there we go that's just gonna be getting five dollars clothing shoes and office will all be getting skipped social media I don't even really know what that is like for I just kind of got it as a custom envelope so yeah I don't really know. Like, I was going to put it, like, all my YouTube checks in there and just save it, but I'm realizing that I kind of need the money elsewhere. But we will just put it in here. 
I mean, excuse me, put a five in there just to feel something, you know? <laughs> so total, that's $10. <clears throat> and I know like this video might not be super exciting because I'm like budgeting a small amount, but I'm really proud of myself and I'm really happy that I got my YouTube check. And that's like really awesome because it's like passive income basically because I didn't post on my YouTube channel for a long freaking time and I still got a check. So that was great. Um, I am, I'm going to stuff a little bit in birthdays in my holiday binder because I need some help buffing that up as well. So we're just going to add an extra, um, what was I thinking? 10. A $10 bill to me is like a freaking 100. I'm like, sheesh, that's so much. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> so total, that's $10. And now left over, we have $76 left over. And that's going to go all into my savings challenge, I think. Unless I find something that catches my eye. Y'all. Okay, let me also tell y'all about this. I want a freaking louis bag so bad and i know like that is just merely like status but it's always something i've att like attained wait what am i trying to say that's also that's always something i've been aspiring yeah that's the word to buy but i mean obviously i cannot i cannot afford that do not get it twisted i cannot afford that right now probably i don't even know when i can afford that but i want it eventually but i just had to tell you all that so that's why i have a luxury savings um envelope i just had to tell you i had to get that off my chest i also really want airpod maxes those are so fire they're fire i know they're literally 500 dollars, and i don't need them but they're so gas so cute but anyways that's my little rant about my luxury things that i want but it's not necessary right now and i can't afford it so that's okay um so beauty amazon etsy furniture fun sporting events electronics oh hold on those are all getting skipped besides electronics, I think, because I might need a new camera soon. Actually, I don't really need it. No. Psych. We're skipping everything just because I'm indecisive. Moving on to my variable expenses. We are going to stuff some stuff in here just so I can get a little bit ahead. Haircuts will be getting $5. Household will be getting um, $5 because we really... Why does it keep doing that? You Oh, y'all. I'm about to lose it. Okay. Household, we really need an AC unit. It's getting really hot in SoCal, so yeah, night out will be getting skipped, supplements getting skipped, and alcohol's getting skipped. So that's just ten dollars. That's um <clears throat> Am I stupid? Literally. Sixty-six dollars. Hello. Okay, now on to my life binder. Over the counter meds. That will be getting skipped. Prescriptions. I really need a copay. Um bind binder jesus <laughs> a copay envelope i realized that because i do have a copay sometimes so i probably should have done that but i might just put it in health insurance so that will just be getting ten dollars so now i have <clears throat> 56 dollars left over to stuff okay now skincare nails this is my self-care Binder, skincare, nails, hair maintenance, wax, massage, skims. Those are all unnecessary things, so they're all getting skipped. Honestly, y'all, like, differentiating between what a want and a need is for me was, like, monumental. Because, like, I honestly used to have no idea. I was like, I need this. I really didn't. So, that's really the key. <laughs> um, my car binder will just be getting skipped. Um, this is my social media binder, but my envelopes aren't in yet, so I'm gonna have to wait on that. My baby binder, I am literally just got my period today, so that's the tea. <laughs> okay, so now we are on to our dollar challenge. Wait, I forgot how much I had left over. 56. Okay, so now we're on to our savings challenges, and, um, I'm excited, because I really like savings challenges, you guys. <clears throat> okay, so let's get, actually get our savings challenge binder and see where we are at. Okay. So, I don't, I don't know if y'all can see that. Let me scoot things over. Okay, cool. Hope y'all can see that. But, um, this is my dollar challenge right here. Let's take out the tracker and see where we're at. And this, these are all dollars, and it adds up to 50. So, I have one, two, three, four, five. There's five in a row, so 10, 11, 12 dollars. Right now in the dollar savings challenge so let's complete the row that's kind of how i like to do things is like completing the row and then we'll see what we have left over after the fact so we have three dollars to complete the third row of this challenge so i'm gonna write that in oh i 
wrote that backwards. Okay. Um, next is the $5 challenge. And we have, let's see. And I'm just taking them out just so y'all can see how cool these savings challenge trackers are. I really like them. Um, this has 5, 10, 15, 20, $25 in the first row. And then we got 30. So we have $30 total in my $250 savings challenge. So to complete this row, we need 5, 10, 15, $20. <clears throat> I keep turning my freaking pencil off. And this is a fake Apple pencil, by the way, you guys. I got it off of Amazon. <laughs> it doesn't work as well as my actual Apple pencil because um, it doesn't let me like rest my hand, as you can see, which is really frustrating. But, you know, it is what it is. Okay, so... I literally keep writing that backwards. Jeez. Okay. Okay, good enough. All right, moving on to our $10 challenge. <clears throat> uh, okay, this one adds up to $500. So this needs three more tens or 30 more dollars to um, complete this row. So 10, 20, 30. Okay, so as you all can see, that totals up to $53 and we need um, $56 to um, zero out our budget so we're just gonna add um three more ones and then that will solve the problem so instead of three ones we're gonna do six yeah <clears throat> So let's total all that out just for clarity purposes. Zero. Okay, awesome. Okay, you guys. That is it for my budget with me. I really hope you liked it. If you did, um, make sure you subscribe. And I really appreciate you guys for subscribing to my channel. That means so much. I already hit 40 subscribers. Um, and so I'm really grateful for that. That's awesome. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. I love you guys so much. Thank you for engaging with me. And I will see you saturday for my cash stuffing this week all right peace bye <laughs>